Why do they think it was me? I would never steal any files of any sort. I don't know, man. But I know it wasn't you. If I were you, I'd figure out a way to get out of the spotlight and capture the real thief. So how can I get my name cleared? I believe I can help you with that. Richard Del Salvio, how long have you been standing there? Long enough. Listen carefully. Meet me outside in the empty lot tomorrow at 9 p.m. sharp. I'll tell you who framed you. You should think carefully about this, but be warned. The wrong decision could lead to disastrous consequences. Might as well go. Just better come prepared. So, it was you that framed me. What was the point of meeting out here? Wouldn't you like to know? What? You? So how do I clear my name? I need your help. You have two options. One, you leave the CIA and America and come to work for me in a private corporation. It's settled in the Antarctica, to which the files had great assistance. Betray the country? Leave the agency? No. No, what's the second option? Second? Oh, uh... Die! What in the world just happened? Hey, man. You all right? Yeah, just a bit perplexed. I don't know why Richard would try to frame me. Well, Mr. Drehouse, that certainly is the million dollar question. <laughs> oh, Charles, always the clumsy one. Oh, by the way, the chief told me to give you this. What? I... I got fired? I'm really sorry about what happened. All I heard the chief say was that you were causing too many problems since you got put under investigation yesterday. Just out of curiosity, what did Richard say to you out there? He offered me a job. A job? A job in Antarctica. Wow. All that in exchange for your name being cleared? Yeah. Maybe that's why he stole the files. If he could steal the files, he could blackmail you into working for him. But why me? I don't know. You were number one in our class. True. But you were last in our class. So it could have been either one of us. So then what are you going to do? If I know you well enough, then I know you won't go down without a fight. You know, you're right. I'm going to go see the chief, regardless of whether she gives me permission or not. I'm going to Antarctica, and I'm going to clear my name. You with me? You bet, dude. You were wrong to come here, Trevor. I told you you would regret it the next time we meet. What do you mean, Chief? I just want to help you get the files back. I need no help in getting them back. What? You? Yes, it is I. <laughs> Richard, we need to get out of here immediately. He could wake any second now. Take him with us. Arise, Trevor Drahos. The time has not yet come for you to expire. I will tell you this. Charles has betrayed you. You think I stole the files? To be honest, Trevor, I've always been working against you. What? You? Seems like that's all you say. I can't believe I just did that. Help! Help! Someone! Help! Is that? Is... Help! Help! Chief! Help! Chief, I'm coming! Help! Chief! Oh, boy, am I glad to see you. 
I'll never doubt you again. Nor shall I ever forget this. Well, let's not dawdle. Richard's put a bomb in the main reactor. Chief, we gotta get out of here. Wait a minute. Chief, is my name clear? Yes, yes, of course, but let's hurry. Drahos, we meet again. I see you managed to escape with your precious chief. Well, we might as well escape together. Ah, no. <laughs> we were never partners. No! God! I've helped you all this time, but to what end? Death? I think not. <laughs> My name. Let's get it clear. Yes, yes, of course. Now let's hurry. Oh wait, you're in the shop. <laughs> Wrong room. Action. <laughs> <laughs> Chief! Oh, boy, am I glad to see you! 